If you haven't noticed here on Discover Arkansas, we like stopping by these roadside shops or maybe even a local farm. Today we're here at the Bemis Honeybee and Tree Farm. I have no idea what they have here other than honeybees and trees, of course. Let's go discover this place. We are Arkansas's largest shade tree transplant specialist is our kind of tagline. Oh. The second thing we do is stump removal, so I kind of just went along with the okay. tree farm. This actually used to be an uh, airplane. Uh, mm. They did skydiving out of here, airstrip. Really? So the, the runway was right out here. It kind of uh, reminds me of a pumpkin patch. That's actually was the name of the airstrip. The rumor was they were the guy that started the place was trying to grow pumpkins out here, and they were making fun of him because he couldn't grow pumpkins. <laughs> we kind of had some idea how to grow Christmas trees, but didn't really know anything about pumpkins, so you can probably guess what the number one reason why pumpkins don't grow is. Um, no pollination. No pollination. We started looking up how to grow pumpkins, and of course, bees was the number one thing. You gotta have enough pollinators. So bees don't like pumpkins. They don't produce hardly any nectar or pollen, so they don't want to go to them. So you mm. kind of have to flood the area with bees to get them to pollinate the pumpkins. I'll be dang. So you'll need as many as two hives per acre to successfully wow. grow pumpkins. You know my honey is from here, so you know what it has pollinated, so what flowers it's gonna have. Um, so if you are eating it for allergies, things like that, yeah. you'll know it's from here. So you guys thing. do classes in here and informational tutorials and, and help people with that, okay. So if you take a class, we'll have a suit. So we, our classes, our goal is that you can come out and just purchase the class without having to buy everything. Okay. And then we'll we'll let you borrow a suit, go so get in the bees. Pay to come to a class. Correct. Learn some stuff, and then from there you make a decision on whether or not you want to invest in yes. a new hot paint. Look, this is not beekeeping 101, but we're going to share something real quick. You have a beehive. Yes. And then you have an insert that goes inside the beehive, which is where the bee lays the wax in and then the honey, and that's where we get Correct. to eat. Yeah. So they'll come in, put wax, and then honey on top, and then more wax to cover it? Uh, yes. So they draw out the comb. Um, so that's there, it's pre started for them there. Yeah. Um, so then it'll come out straight like that mm -hmm. and then they'll fill it up with honey, eggs, larva, uh, whatnot. So I've learned everything there is to know about beekeeping, or well, maybe not, but I'm definitely coming back to Bemis Family Farm where they have a little bit of everything. Get out here and discover this place and go discover Arkansas.